Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to this, not the inaugural, but uh, this year's um, mid, well, uh, mid lockdown 48 hour dagger build off. Yeah. Um, with me, I have got my good mate, Mr. Stuart Smith. So uh, let's bring him in. And, dude, I hope you're hand standing. Oh, what's that? Hello. <laughs> yes, I was, I promise. <laughs> I was freaking printed, man. <laughs> All right, buddy. So uh, in uh, less than half an hour, we start uh, this year's, well, um, build-off, right? Yeah, 48-hour build-off. I'm very excited about it. I wasn't excited about anything at the beginning of the week. Well, on the weekend. Yeah, uh, I only got to bed at 12 last night. Um, this I thing know. Is I saw your sketch. Crap, dude. dude that thing has dude, been driving me nuts. Did you see what I wrote? Hey? I said, no, I didn't looking not. at your sketch makes me think of somebody trying to ice skate up a hill. <laughs> I think I, I, I dug myself a hole there. It's um, a lot of hard work there. Dude, Look, I mean, I, but, I, I know a lot uh, of I mean, us are going to sleep tonight at about 9 or 10, whatever. I don't think Nils is sleeping for the next 20, for next 48 hours. Not with that night. No, no, no. I, I, I need to sleep. I uh, suck if I don't have at least four hours of sleep in uh, my body. So I'm actually planning. The, the plan is to uh, to sleep both evenings uh, at least four hours. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, but um, I, I honestly believe that I might just, just, just be able to uh, pull this off, man. So we've got a lot of guys already popping in. Yeah, so yeah. we've got Francois, Francois saying Hazard. hi. Uh, Johanna saying there, how's it going, gentlemen? Ladies. Stefan from Milan, how's it? That's it. Okay, so uh, any comments from the group? Um, we're streaming live uh, to both my personal profile as well as the 48-hour Dagger Build-Off group. All right, um, so... Uh, before we start, I want to get the formalities done, right? Um, so anywhere in the world, doesn't matter where you are, you start Monday, 12 o'clock. So we know that the guys in uh, Tasmania and the guys in Australia has already been done. Uh, Sam, who is in uh, Australia, um, he commented um, that he's already five hours in. And the guys are already yeah. posting photos and little clips of what they're doing, which is brilliant. Um, so uh, if you do want to do this, um, uh, this this whole thing via from Instagram to Facebook uh, to your personal profile, all you then need to do is share that uh, uh, post you've done. Um, from your personal profile into the group, yeah? But it has to end up in yeah. the group because that's where we want people to go and, and actually have a look at it. Um, no, and the prim the primary, primary source of uh, sharing. Sorry. Yeah, man, and I'll we've had an 111 new members sign up um, in the last seven days, which is absolutely cool. brilliant, which is obviously from uh, Thursday last week when we, we announced this. Yeah, so yeah. Uh, currently we have got, um, I think it's 639 members in the group um, and, uh, yeah, man, this is freaking awesome. Okay. So when it says Facebook user, we know that it is, uh, from the group, the 48 hour knife build off. Uh, so guys, if you're joining us and watching us from the 48 hour dagger build off group, uh, please just start your comment with your name. Yeah. So we actually know what it is. Otherwise you need to give, uh, uh, my software actually, uh, permission to read your details. Uh, then we've got Johan Yilof uh, getting very, very excited. Yeah? Yep. <laughs> uh, Michel Zwan. Uh, yeah, buddy. We are... Uh... <laughs> A lot of coffee in the future. Definitely, <laughs> man. Definitely. Um... Okay. Um, yeah, money. Uh, that's, you you yeah. should join in. This is going to be good fun. So, Steve, you've got your design, right? Yes, I do. It's, uh, and have you got it with you? I, uh, yes. uh, as, as a matter of fact, no, I'm no, going to no, get, get it. Hang on. Oh, okay. He's no, going to no. get it. So, once is going to get his uh, thing, uh, we, uh, at, at this point, we are, uh, we've got 26 competitors from all over the world playing with, and I just want to run through a couple of uh, things that need to happen. All right. Uh, specifications on the build. It has to be a symmetrical dagger. Yeah. Um, what happens on the left side of the dagger and what happens on the right side of the dagger, it has to be the same. Um, it must have a cross guard or a guard and a pommel. Yeah. Uh, construction method is uh, a narrow tang uh, or through tang construction. 
um, then the blade steel is any carbon steel. Can you use Damascus? Yes. Do you have do you have to make the Damascus? No. Uh, could you start and make the Damascus beforehand? Um, yes, that's acceptable. Uh, what else is there? Manufacturing method, man. Anything go. Um, in the uh, uh, group, I've got uh, forging, stock removal, CNC, casting, whatever. You can... Uh, we've, we've lost Mr. Smith there. Uh, but he will be back. There we go. He is coming back in. There we go. Welcome back, buddy. Um, yes, I found and, it. Uh, I mean, I, I even said you could uh, nibble at your blade for whatever reason. Yeah. All you need yeah. to do is make a dagger. Who, no one cares... Or how you do it. Just do it, yeah. man. Uh, I also found that uh, at, at one point, I'm going to probably be ending up uh, uh, doing a lot of file work. Yeah. Because I've got yes. files. Most of them I is mean, blunt. I I, I, I'm going to make up for Niels's file work by actually forging my Damascus from scratch. So, Dude. I, did, I, you, I, I know you, uh, said, oh, you could have prepared it beforehand, but uh, where's the challenge? Really? So I've set aside this afternoon for he I've is set aside get this a afternoon yeah. for um, forging my Damascus billet complete, grinding, and if I'm lucky I'll do heat treat late this evening. And the blade will be ready for after tempering overnight, will be ready for polishing and I'll do the handle the whole of tomorrow. I reckon I'll be done before the uh, the end of the, the, the timeline. So, but I'll take, I'll, I'll take, if there's any time extra, I'll take the time to maybe put a few embellishments on. Excellent, man. And uh, Johan Yellow just made a, 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 well, just asked a very valid question is, are we going to allow for sales opportunities on the page? Ladies and gentlemen, if you are seeing anything that you really dig, like Mr. Seward Smith's design over there, right, um, contact the maker directly. Yeah. Uh, don't leave a message on uh, Facebook and hope that and praise that he gets back to you. Uh, contact the maker directly, send him a DM, send him, send him a personal message, um, and haunt him. Yeah, Keep in mind that he's got 48 hours. He wants to uh, uh, complete the dagger. Yeah, He, he doesn't want to sell. Well, all of these blades, as far as I'm concerned, uh, if you've got enough money, that thing is available. Yeah, Shipping, yeah. obviously, will be a bit of a problem. So as soon as we're out of lockdown, uh, those things will be shipped. Um, I personally have already had an, a, 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 an interested party. Um, which is cool, yeah. Uh, the guys yeah, are really everybody pushing. Everybody buys your daggers, Niels. Yeah, man. Which is which is really cool, right? So, but uh, this gentleman is obviously uh, new to the game for me or with me. I don't do yeah. pricing beforehand. Um, so, yeah, I even price all, it after, although yeah. I'm building this thing in 48 hours, and if I hope and pray to the files and the whatever, all the gods that's out there, yeah. yeah? Uh, <laughs> If I pull this off, uh, a comment was made on my uh, on, on on Instagram saying, uh, "If I build this thing in forty eight hours, it's going to go fairly cheaply." Um, no, and uh, no, no, it's, it's, are, it's inverse proportion. Under eight, I want you to say or just do this because I'm going to go. Fuck no. Fuck, yeah. You are no, paying it's inverse for proportions. the last eleven it's, years the, worth the less of time my it takes you, oil. The more you charge, and you are paying for every single burn scar. That I have gained over the last eleven years, yeah, all yeah. the stupid mistakes. Uh, that's what you'll be paying for, man. Yeah, and my lack yeah. of sleep comes at a fucking premium. <laughs> oh come on, do, do, do yeah. you know uh, uh, Will's knife? Do you know Will's knife that he made, the little one that he hand yeah. filed? He's selling that for a thousand dollars. Oh, but that's Will. So, man. That, that's Will. I know, I know, I know, I know. But I'm just saying, uh, with the amount of skill that he has, he had opted to do it by hand. So there's a considerable more skill involved in doing it the hard way. Anybody can stick an eye to a grinder and grind it, you know. Uh, we've got a legend in the house. Owen, how's it uh, going? Man? Owen, at this point, sir, we have got, uh, let me just quickly have a look, uh, 27 guys uh, participating. Um, Owen, and uh, man, let me know whether you received the brooch I sent you, um, but that was a bit off topic. But, okay, so we have got 19 minutes according to, well, 18 minutes according to uh, my little watch uh, before this thing starts. Right? And I need to say, as soon as I say go, dude, I'm going to cut the feed. I'm going <laughs> to be off. Right? <laughs> Pretty much that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, then uh, uh, who is saying what here? Yeah, Johanna saying. 
Yeah, buddy. Uh, you, you're paying for my blood, yeah. sweat, and tears. More importantly, for my lack of sleep. Uh... <laughs> no. So, uh, Mr. Zwan over there is already stocking up on, on fresh coffee. Now, uh, Tulu <laughs> is sitting right next to me. He is once again participating. And for the guys Excellent. that have done the very, very first one we ever did, uh, we'll remember that he actually won the first one. He was done in something like 14 hours. Now, this year, wow. I've already spoken to him. He's not allowed to uh, just finish it, stick it together, and call it done. He has to work the full 48 hours, yeah? Yeah, put, put everything into it, yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so, uh, Owen is saying that he wished he'd seen this earlier. Um, brother, what you need to do is you, you can start whenever, yeah? Uh, just keep to the 48 hours. That, that's it. Uh, okay. Go into the group. Come on, come on. Come on, Owen, you've got 15 minutes to get ready. What's the problem? He's in England time. It's the same as us. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He's uh, also GMT Bus too. Um, so uh, 15 minutes. Oh. Uh, you can say, look, I'm only going to start at okay, tomorrow at 12 o'clock. Yeah. Um, we will only do the judging, and I'll still figure out how we're going to do that. I think we will have participants voting. Um, I don't think we're going to let the public in on this one. Because uh, what happened on the very first one is we had uh, one of the contestants uh, that went around to his mates on his personal profile and uh, uh, got a load of guys to join the group and then swing the vote that way, which is not going to happen this year. I can promise you that. Yeah, Last yeah. year, well, the, the, the second one we did, um, we actually opted uh, for the guys, uh, the participants, to vote on a winner, which worked brilliantly. And this year we'll do the same. Um, yeah. Okay. So we're continuing on the rules. Yeah. So um, yes. what happens if you finish your dagger? All right. And you have got time left. Can you do a sheath? Yes, you can. How many brownie points will that score you? A bucket load. An absolute fucking bucket load. If you do okay. a sheath with it. Yeah. But if you do a sheath, we're going to judge the sheath, right? It's as easy as that. Yeah. Um, and then, obviously, your dagger has to be fucking exceptional if you then uh, uh, want to go and make a sheath as well. Uh, so I don't think there are going to be anyone. But um, I don't know. I also think I can do that dagger in 48 hours. <laughs> yeah, but uh, also remember, Niels, the uh, amount of effort you put into your dagger is more important than the effort you put into a sheath. So say you're an excellent sheath maker. It's not a 48-hour sheath uh, competition. You know, that it is, it's all um, about the dagger. That it, well, that it is not. Yeah. Uh, when you show it live, Sorry. I don't know. I, if you follow, I think, I don't know. What I reckon is, because um, I, I usually do my live profile, my live posts on my personal page, but I don't have a function to post both at the 48 hour and my personal page like you do. So I think anybody okay, so who wants to show live stuff. To, yeah, I yeah. I think if we do your live, live thing, your personal. Yeah. Yeah, and then share it to the um, – afterwards, share it to the 48-hour page. Yeah. That's it. That's it. Because uh, not a lot of guys have got um, admin rights, and you need admin rights in the group to go live, I think. I'm not sure because we don't want to figure that out right now. Um, so I'm yeah. going to flip us off the screen, and I'm uh, going to add – why? Let's let's do that. Hey? Um, Just accidentally log so on to the else's again, <laughs> Facebook user, that is someone that's in the 48-hour dagger build-off group at the moment uh, that is commenting, yeah? So for the guys that are on their cell phones, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to have that there, all right? Um, so I did say, uh, guys, who sound off. And uh, let's quickly have a look. Uh, okay, obviously, I was in Tim Brown, Juan Hendrik de Vett. We've got uh, William Tom Smith, Tian Berger. Uh, Gavin Dickinson, Dylan Berman, uh, Colin Muller, all the way out of the States. Uh, Robbie Beaton, Sam Towns. Sam is in Australia, and that's why he's saying he's already in for five hours. Um, Jacques de Villiers, Hilton Rufford, uh, Michelle Zwine, uh, Zwan, Zwine, damn it. Uh, Alvin Marx, Charles van Rooyen, Jacques Mongus, um, Gerrit Wieser, Tim Flack, Trenton Stander. Uh, Grant Stein, Tian van Niekerk, Johan Ilof, Thijs de Jager, Willy van der Merwe. All right, so that's the guys that have thrown their hats in so far. I'm pretty sure we yeah. will have uh, other guys that come in um, with it 
um, as soon as they actually see that I did that post in there. Uh, what else is in here? Yeah, let's have a look uh, at some of the guys. Um, and also, frankly, uh, if you say, oh, I don't, I don't have time for that. Uh, well, you know, <laughs> we're, we're kind of in lockdown. You've got nothing but time on your hands. Exactly. So uh, if you want to see the rules... Um, all you need to do is on the left of the page, you'll see there's a dagger build off there, and it's about discussion, and click on announcements, and that, that'll bring you to this. There's two announcements at the moment, uh, the guys that are participating, which is that list there, and then the second one, um, and we had Willie's mug in there, uh, second one, which is this here. So uh, that has to be a symmetrical dagger, blah, 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 no sheet. And the most important thing that you guys will need to remember is that we require a post to this group every two hours yeah uh the only exception you have is if you decide to go for a bit of a nap or for lunch yeah okay but please uh a lot of guys are asking me this uh, what if i forget don't forget you've got a cell phone stick a timer on there um and hit that timer click all right every two hours every two hours yeah, yeah? Um, in the group there is a posting i did with regards to what hashtags you should be using yeah um, so uh, tag those and those are pretty much um, so that if I then click oh, and this thing is now terribly so because I'm obviously streaming to this page as well all right so uh, we've got uh, Jacques six minutes ago who started his forge already is that allowed yes it is he's not working <laughs> yet he's just fired up his forge yeah he's just fired up his forge man uh, so we're over there what we let, let, let's see <laughs> Yeah, that was like a couple of hours ago already. Yeah, yeah. so uh, that's Alex. Out yeah, of he's making my favorite sites. Thanks. Well, good luck, Alex. Um, let me just kill that one. Uh, Tim Flack. Uh, this is what he's going for. Oh, crikey. He's going to uh, make a Mordor blade. Nice. Yeah, dude. Nothing like... Uh, Doing something that people already know, right? Uh, with mine, yeah. it's a sketch, and I can I can wiggle around that. But doing something like that, dude, you're yeah. a braver man than I am. Yeah. Um, and then uh, Jacques Mongus is already running into issues. He's going to have to do everything by hand because, uh, well, he's power hammer conked out, right? Eesh. Well, the isolator switch. So, um, well, at least he's got a drawing on his anvil. <laughs> yeah. Well, good luck, brother. Then we've got oh, Tim Brown, um, and I think that is where he unveiled his uh, design. Let's uh, quickly have a look in here. I am uh, just going to jump forward. Ooh, there we go. I like that. He's got a Masters with Lin Ray inspired design there. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude. That is cool. So uh, for the guys viewing, go onto the group and you can uh, go and have a look and, and listen to what the guys are saying and, and how they're doing and how, what they're going to be approaching this in. Uh, Harad Vishra is saying, I'm in, which is brilliant. And Harad, I'm believing, I, I don't know what that is. That looks like a really prep piece of Damascus and that looks like a piece that he's going to be doing. Um, yeah. I don't know, but there's no comments. Yeah. Uh, Sam Towns in Australia has taken a, uh, a file and has forge these bevels in which is now leaving him these half moon half moon uh little marks on the the center line which i believe is going to look freaking awesome sam i like what you're doing there yeah. brother and as you guys can see i already love these little polo um yes uh johan hendrik the vets that's his little thingy hilton is now going live as well uh there's his design you can see hilton rutherford is now live yeah and he's live on his personal profile Okay, yeah. what else have we got? Uh, we've got uh, Mr. Zwan. Uh, we've got Tian Fanikak saying he's forged prepped and the raw materials are set. Uh, so, dude. And then Colin Miller, Miller is an extremely promising uh, uh, young smith also out of the States. And brother, I like that. Now, yeah. this dagger here was the inspiration, bless you, was the inspiration for uh, two or three daggers ago. That I built. Remember the one I did down in Cape Town with Stan? That was yeah. the base where we took this from. Yeah. Uh, but, dude, I like those. I particularly like that one and that one. But all of these, these little daggers are exceptional, man. Um, then we have got uh, Chris. Uh, 40 hours left. 
Yeah, so he's already been uh, he's 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 been running for eight hours plus. When he that's when he did the post, which was an hour ago. So Chris, yeah. sorry buddy, you've got thirty nine hours left. Um, but what he did was he milled a slot, a, a fuller in his blade, and then he yeah. filled it with uh, um, bronze. So in other words, he uh, uh, what's it brazed bronze rod in that sense. Yeah. Yeah, and I don't know if that bend is now from the bronze. Somebody else let's, has gone let's, live. Let's let's find out. I think it's someone on the commented on it. Chris is filing, man. Say something, buddy. Bronze is so soft. I can't work outside anymore because I'm going to upset the neighbors. Um, so resorted to uh, all the hand filing. Now, what you see here isn't just the camera lens bending it. This thing is very bent. So oh, I'll work out these distortions. You see that? Um, That's not where you need good luck, brother. Okay, so Chris needs to uh, do a, a tempering straightening that uh, Lynn, uh, what's it? Um, uh, oh, crap, I can't remember his name. Anyway, one of the American master smiths uh, told me uh, that you clamp your blade to a piece of steel with the high spot up and you clamp down the middle while it's tempering so that you don't have to do yeah, a full straightening is... jig, you know what I mean? Yeah, and I'll I do that, and I'll tell you something: on, yeah. the nastiest bends and warps shit that comes out in the temper. It's amazing. Yeah, but I I, I don't know whether that's heat treated yet. Uh, that might have just been from the the actual uh, um, when he brazed the bronze on there. Yeah, that might have been where it uh, warped. Neil, I'm oh, only I don't hearing every know. second word there. All right, so uh, let me let me kill this feed. All right, so uh, let's get the the screen out of there. There we go. This should be better now. How's that? Nope. I'm getting oh, auto tuned, Niels. <laughs> Having trouble connecting. I'm right next to my Wi-Fi, so I know. It's oh man, we just dropped Stuart. All right, well, still, we'll be back in a, in a moment. All right, so, um, Johan, this is an honor system, yeah? Um, so, uh, I mean, if, you, if you're considering uh, hey, pre-made stuff, um, so Johan is saying that he's wondering if someone uh, had a pre-made stuff, uh, like a guard or a pommel uh, that they can use, doesn't have to be made new. Um, it's an honor system, right? You're, you're working against yourself. Um, and uh, I believe that the guys won't do that. Yeah, it's as easy as that, man. Um, Alex is saying, uh, how's it going, man? You should be working. Alex, we have got another five minutes to go, buddy. Yeah, five minutes. Yeah, man. How's it going, ladies and gentlemen? Yeah. So uh, we've got a couple of guys watching. And, uh, well, you saw what craziness I'm going to attempt? Dude. This thing <laughs> is going to drive me funking bonkers. So I did ask the guys, uh, long or short quillen, right? Uh, short quillen being on this side and long quillen on that side, which is there. And a lot of guys actually gave me some feedback. And uh, there's two master smiths that mentioned. Well, I'll try and come back in again, Neil, so I'm losing right. everything. Oh, man. All right. But anyway, we have got four minutes oh, remaining. Now I can hear you. Sure. Four minutes <laughs> remaining. Yeah, so uh, ladies and gentlemen, I don't want to say grab your files, yeah, because uh, but grab grab your material and stand by. Yeah, Gore is saying and that uh, he can't wait. With, you just want him to see me screw up. That's it. Yeah. Neither can we. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Cora, thank you, brother. That is appreciated, man. Yeah, dude. Uh, I mean, we, we're doing this to get out of comfort zones and uh, just to play a bit, right? Mr. Yeah. Eric Elts. Uh, Eric, yeah, dude. So, on the next one, which uh, we'll pretty much do in a, in a couple of weeks from now, three minutes remaining. Three minutes yeah. remaining before we can start. Um, we will be doing another one, uh, very shortly. Yeah. 
Stefan from Berlin. Good luck to everyone. All right. So, so I don't have a little countdown timer. I am relying on the small little clock on the side of the screen. Um, so um, <sighs> still three minutes remaining. Uh, uh, David Francis is saying, "Hey, yeah, buddy. Um, so after lockdown, uh, he's out there in Namibia, right? Uh, Southwest Africa. Um, so out in Namibia, um, brother, you should have enough handle material, right? Uh, <laughs> but uh, you, you stock up after lockdown and uh, we, we, we'll catch you on the next one, which would be, let's call it three, four weeks. Um, and then we've got... Uh, Oh, <laughs> excellent, Alec. Um, I'm, I'm glad you're, you're enjoying this site so far. Uh, Facebook user, which is telling me that you're joining us from the 48-hour Dagger Build-Off group. Um, please, next on you comment. Uh, and hello, sir. Uh, just add your name before you actually comment out of the group. And uh, But thank you for the comment. It's appreciated, man. Mr. Tim Brown is saying, yeah, rule one. Rule one, if for the guys that joined us new, uh, rule one in my shop is don't fuck up. Yeah. So that one is my mantra when I'm sitting and filing. And Tim is telling me uh, to not forget that. Uh, dude, I'm going to so try not to do this, right? Uh, to not screw up. And I've got no idea. Stuart is uh, in and then he's not in. There we go. Stuart, you're back, buddy. It's not half frustrating. But yeah, I'm going to start packing my Damascus now. Yeah, you, you, you can start doing that. It's one minute to go. Yeah, yeah. this is not going to be very accurate because um, I, I can't really see. I don't have a second yeah. timer. It's no, seconds. It's what, I'll, I'll say when. I've, I've, I've got a – I can do, the, do it on mine. Well, okay, okay, hold on. 11, 59, 21, uh, 25. Yeah. So – I am going to cut this thing pretty much. Um, good luck, gentlemen. Trent, same to you, buddy. Uh, Dion Nala saying, you go, guys. Thanks, Dion. Uh, Dion, you are joining us, Sam. You're not. Okay, so 15 seconds to go. <laughs> and three, two, two. one. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, your tools and run. Yeah, that was the official start. Start stacking, go, start go, filing, go, go. start grinding. Right, so that is the last comment we're doing. Uh, Stu, brother, good luck. Have fun. All right, and uh, we'll catch you guys uh, a bit later. I know that the guys are now commenting like freaking mad. Um, thank you. And, uh, well... See you on the first couple of posts, right? Uh, follow everyone. Go onto the group on the guys that have listed and go and follow them. Um, and then mark C first. Um, when you follow them, don't send them friend requests, right? Uh, just click follow and then mark to C first. And you will see every single one of those posts that are coming through. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining us um, on the kickoff. Uh, it's now, well, almost a minute past. I need to get my ass going, right? Um, yeah, i got to fire up my forge. And then I gotta find see if I can handle material to make this damn knife now. I didn't even check yet. Oh, dude. <laughs> <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, have fun. We're out of here. Good luck, everybody. Just uh, just and good luck to each and every one of the competitors. Um, and uh, you guys are freaking legends, man. Now go get this. <laughs>